Hello everyone and welcome to this uh, quick demonstration how to deploy the latest uh, patch in regards to the Adobe Flash uh, play vulnerability. Uh, first of all, this is the Secunia Corporate Software Inspector. Uh, we have here the dashboard where we are provided with some information about uh, scan results and some general statistics. But of course here on the results we have a, a accumulated view of all the insecure application that is detected in my network. And as you can see here, I have Adobe Flash Player here. Let me just do a sorting on the product name. You can see that it's 16 insecure installation and 12 hosts. So of course this is a high priority for me to patch. And since uh, Adobe, as of today, day, the 21st uh, of uh, September, released a patch for the Adobe Flash Player, I would like to make sure that that is deployed correctly. And of course I need to do that by going to uh, patch here in the CSI and then create a patch. The Adobe Flash Player has two different uh, features, the NP API and the ActiveX component. So I'm just going to start with uh, working with the ActiveX component. To create an update, I'm then selecting the different paths where this vulnerability is present on my hosts in my network. I click on Next. I can then click to download the patch from the vendor itself or I uh, actually have pre-downloaded it so I'm just going to browse the file and select that, uh, that, that patch. Then the silent parameter is already provided by Secunia so I just click on Next here. I can tag my name to it so I know who created the patch and click finish. What will happen now is that the CSI will take the, the paths and the patch and also a certificate to bundle that together into a cabinet format file and upload that to my WSUS server. So you can see here the update was successfully created and published to your Microsoft WSUS server. To view the update statistics and to approve the update click available in the menu. So let's do that then. So if I go to available here, I'm able to see my Adobe Flash Player 10 point text version with my name on it here. So I'm just going to right click, approve it. I will then be able to read the WSUX structure that I have today in regards to the groups that I have uh, created. But I know that I would like to distribute this to all computers. So I'm selecting all computer here and just click OK. The next step is to make sure that the Windows update fetches this from my WSUS server and installs it correctly. And you can see here, new updates are available. One important update is available. So I'm just going to click on that one to verify. And you can see that it's Adobe Flash Player. So I'm just going to click OK here. Now it's preparing to install. It's downloading the updates. Now let's click again. So it's creating a restore point and soon it would st start the installation itself. So here we go. The update was successfully installed. So now I have the, um, in a very easy and straightforward way, I've done the patching of uh, Adobe Flash Player. Thank you for watching and um, good luck with uh, patching uh, the Adobe Flash Player.